have you heard of something called ESP before? ESP stands for extrasensory perception, okay? And back in the sort of 1930s, they developed ways of test, creating tests to try and work out if people could transmit thoughts to each other in separate rooms and that kind of thing. They developed these simple symbols and they became known as ESP symbols. Okay, now we've got two sets of these cards here and they're both exactly the same. Now I'm going to use you, Tiny, for this if that's okay. So would you like to use that set or would you like to use this set? It's entirely up to you.